Okay. Got your eye on your target. Got your arrow knocked. Now how are you going to grip it so you can aim and fire? I like this one. It's the Asiatic thumb, right? There's a couple of variations depending on how you want to hold it. But I like having my arrows in my hand so I know where they're at. Thumb around. You draw. Okay. That's the Asiatic thumb draw. I forget which old school they did the same thing except that they grabbed it and used this finger and held it in place here right I ain't used to this and I don't do a right hand draw I do a left hand draw but that's the image right there boom it goes all the way back to when the Greeks won I forget yeah, the, the Greeks won a, won a battle, and they said it was because the other archers didn't know how to shoot where the darn. But that's how they were holding the bow. I mean, the arrow. Take it. Right there. That's your lock. Grip it. Point. Point. See, this is where aiming comes in, and that's the next step. Doesn't matter. And if you really want to do it, I would suggest if you're going to use your fingers, two fingers on, one to hold the arrow. Again, point. Pointing is important. Pointing is very important. Especially if you're using your dominant hand on the arrow. Or, if you're using your dominant hand on the bow, huh? Alright, pointing's important. Instinctive. Alright, next.